In this video I will show you how you can get the best FPS on Valorant for low-end PC. But before, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and like. Go here, type Optimize, press on Defragment and Optimize Drives. Select your C drive. Then press here on Optimize. Wait a few seconds. When it is done, go to the other drives you have. First press on Analyze. Then Optimize. Go here, type Graphics, press on Graphics Settings. Make sure you have this on. Then press here on Browse. Press on your local disk. Then press on the Riot Games folder. Go to Valorant. Then Live. Go to Shooter Game. Binaries. Win64. And this is the right file you need to find. First right click on it, press on Properties. Here you have to go to Compatibility. Check Disable Full Screen Optimization. Then go here to change High DPI Settings. Check this box. Then press OK. Press Apply. OK. Then select it. Press here on Add. When you have this here, press on Options. Here check High Performance. Press on Save. Go back here to Settings Home. Go to Gaming. On the Xbox Game Bar, select this to Off. Then on the Game Mode, select this to On, for the optimization from Graphics Settings to work. Now if you have a NVIDIA video card, go to this website, link in description. All this info you can find on internet about your video card if you don't know. Here select your product type. Your product series. The name of video card. Then operation system. Select Windows 10 64-bit. Download type. Select game ready driver. And language. Select English. Press on search. Then press on download. Download again. And it will download here. When it is done, press on it, and press on open. This page will pop up, press OK. Wait a few seconds, then this will pop up. Check NVIDIA graphics driver, then press agree and continue. Check express, then press next. Wait a few minutes, when the NVIDIA graphics driver is done, press here on close. If you have a AMD Radeon video card, go to this website, here you can update your driver, just press on the download button and follow the steps to be up to date. Now you need to have the ultimate performance guide on your PC, so go here, type CMD, right click on command prompt, and press on run as an administrator. Then this page will pop up, here you have to paste a command, copy this command from my description, and just right click and paste it here, then press enter, and now you have the ultimate performance guide, but to activate it, you need to close the page, then go here, type choose, press on choose a power plan, then check ultimate performance, and now you have it activated. Now go to this website, you will find the link in the description, scroll down until you see this download button, press on the first one, it will download here, when it is done, press on it, and press on open. Double click on it. This page will pop up, press next. Check this. Then press next. Next again. And install. Wait a few seconds, make sure you have this checked. Press finish. It will open automatically, now here on the system power plan. You have to select ultimate performance because that's how I set it before as you saw. Then here on the core parking, drag this to 100%. Frequency scaling, drag this to 100%. Turbo boost, drag it to 100%. And performance, also to 100%. Then press here on apply. Press OK. Close this page. Go to this website now. Timer resolution. Press here on free download. Then press on download now. It will download here, when it is done, press on it and press on open. Double click on this, and this little page will pop up. Now as you can see here on the current resolution is 1000 milliseconds. Press here on maximum. And now it will be half of these milliseconds. You just have to minimize this page and let it run in the background when you play the game. Then when you are done with the game, just press here on default. 
and close the page. Now right click on the screen, press on NVIDIA control panel. This page will pop up, go to adjust image settings with preview, check use the advanced 3D image settings, press apply. Then go here to manage 3D settings. Here we have to change some settings, open GL rendering GPU, select your video card, power management mode, select prefer maximum performance, texture filtering quality, select high performance, threaded optimization, select on, and vertical sync, select off. Press on apply, then go here to adjust desktop color settings. Scroll down to digital vibrance, move this to 70%, press apply. Close the page, now open the game. When you are here in the lobby, go to this icon up here. Go to settings, to video, then to general. On the display mode, select full screen. Resolution, select 16 by 9. Monitor, select your monitor. Aspect ratio method, select letterbox, press apply. Limit FPS on battery, select off. Limit FPS in menus, select off. Limit FPS in background, select off. Limit FPS always, select off. And if you have a NVIDIA video card, select here on plus boost for low and PC. Then go up here to graphics quality. On the multi-threaded rendering, select on. Material quality, select low. Texture quality, select low. Detail quality, select low. All quality, select low. Vignette, select off. Vertical sync, select off. Anti-aliasing, select none. Anisotropic filtering, select one. Improve clarity, select off. Experimental sharpening, select off. Bloom, select off. Distortion, select off. And cast shadows, select off. Then go up here to stats. On the client FPS, select text only, so you can see the FPS in real time, then press on close settings, and now enjoy the game. One kill remaining. If you're not a good shot today, don't worry. There are other ways to be useful. Fight! Deep breath. No more secrets. 